Alexa, what date is it? Today is Saturday, October 14th. And Alexa, what time is it? The time is 1.08 a.m. Okay, folks, so you hear that? Hi, family. Enlarge it. Now it's really bright in the sight line. It's the only one I can see at the moment. Let's move the phone to the centre. So it's located at the centre of the screen. Okay, there you go. Now before um, the moon instance were expanded and contracted um, again when I quoted it to um, I was told some information like I said previously there's some information I'm going to um, share with you that's relating directly to me um, and it's some di information that's directly to humanity the 97% of us okay that i will share and some information i won't share because it's just too um provocative provocative information um and some of it is just like okay but in this one i want to share it with the moon and before the the sort of there's a another craft and it's quite low in the skyline and quite faint so you won't see it hopefully another craft will appear okay so regarding the targeting and even before the targeting um, my family informed me that um, oh there's another craft as well they've making themselves visible now and I'm, oh, my eyes are getting used to looking out in the brightness they informed me that this was going to happen that this connection with my family was going to take place is that correct So this was this um, connection was decided before I was born regarding my soul would connect with my clan. No matter where I was in the world, no matter um from really fuck up as a human being, that this connection would take place. I'll move the phone to the centre again. Is that correct family? Um, and regarding the targeting, this is completely separate. These completely separate issues altogether. This is not happening. Um, my connection with my family because of the targeting, but their involvement has included the targeting. So they've sort of like named people and confirmed people that are involved. People in the inverted commas, um, and the targeting um, happened because I was stalked by a convicted rapist. Um, and various MPs, councillors, uh, Dublin Council, West Midlands Police. I've done everything to cover up because of what's happening now. Like I say, we all are being targeted, but I'm being um, targeted in a very overt way. And it's all to do because he is one of them. And they've actually told me right at the very beginning, I keep saying this, this is about control. And this is about sex offenders. And this is about, yeah, race has got things to do with it. But you will notice black people are involved in this, Asian people are involved in this, women are involved in this, okay? Sexual deviance is at the core of the, because they've got no connection to the clan, no connection to their soul. This is why, um, and it's not natural between two consenting adult sex. It's rape, it's infant rape, it's child abuse, it's adult rape it's child um it's things that are a deviant to the natural practices of normal to 
consenting adults getting freaky together and it's been done deliberately i keep saying this um regarding rapists um if you want to know somebody if you want and that's why i keep going on and on and on about it um because i didn't know like i said previously in my previous jobs i've worked with sex offenders um and you sort of shut off for what they are in order to do the job in order to be able to fucking chat with these beasts you have to shut off okay um and it's not till the connection with family um and if you want to know who who have got overlays just, just look at um um a repeat sex offender if you want to know who has got entity attachments um look at a repeat sex offender is that correct family Okay, look at a repeat sex offender. Keep looking. If you want to know who who is not who is not connected to a creator, to the creator of the earth, the solar system, who are not connected to their soul, um, their heart's not connected. Just look at sex offenders. Okay, and they're doing it because whoever runs them, the entities on them, are doing everything to destroy humanity as it is. Okay, and it's been so prevalent in this civilization that it's it made its way into into religious texts, and um, that a man cannot control himself. That women are a sexual beast or the virgins, or you know what I mean. It's it's always um, very rarely were you were you um, the religious texts was describe it in a loving and positive way, and that means sex when I say that. I'm getting off course now. So yeah, the reason why I was talking is because, and I keep saying, go through my history, okay, and look at all the companies, and this is why I want to name all the companies involved and all the people involved, um, because it is such an embodiment, embodiment, can't even speak, against mankind. Everybody, all the local authorities. The police officers, um, Chief Inspector Hobday, who's involved right from the very beginning, who's a child molester. Is that correct? Family. And I'm going to come on to Chief, Inspe Chief Inspector Hobday in a moment, okay? Anyway, so I was told, so this is what it's all about, um, the targeting. It's nothing to do um, with my family. Okay, they hate this is happening. They hate me having this contact. Anything greater than them, um, and they're so stupid because, like I keep saying, if you go back to the corners, they believe there is no God. Okay, they believe that it's the everybody's got entity attachments. They believe that children enjoy being sexually molested and raped. That's their philosophy. Okay, look at the Freemasons in Dudley. Um, just look at who, where I've lived and who must have been involved for this to be taking place. Okay? And then look at, especially in the UK, look at your celebrities in the papers. I'm going to go on to, I might go on to buy them another time. When they say, yeah, yeah, you've been sort of involved, but the person has been 16 years old. That's a lie. Okay? And when I talk about this, these um, sex offenders that have died... Um, previously, all around the world, all um, throughout the civilization, every sex offender, I can guarantee it, has been tortured, has been, um, yeah, tortured basically, because of their acts, because of their acts against humanity, their acts against a person. Is that correct, family? Every one of them. Okay, so Ginny Savile now um, is being tortured. Is that correct? Every sex offender you can think of that's ever existed, that's alive now, will be tortured. And that includes the people that um, are conspired to protect their image in the past and that are still doing it now. You even say, or even saying now, oh, we didn't know, you fucking liars, yes, you did. Look at the last person that Jimmy Savile um, was photographed with, a celebrity. 
And he says, oh, no, we didn't know. Um, Jeremy Salmon got OBE. The royal family. <laughs> That's another thing, the British royal family. Um, look how many um, sex offenders that comes out after they've died. Um, I've got OBEs, MBEs. Okay. This is a system that's been put in place to fool humanity, to mock humanity, the 97% of us, because they have no connection to a creator, they have no connection to soul, to source, and it's the greatest thing. If you if you can get a child and to break their spirit, to break their soul, that's it, it's a win for them. It's nothing to do with a child liking it or a child enjoying it. They know what they're doing. It's to break the connection, that child's connection with the creator, with their clan. Is that correct, family? And everybody, every every organisation um, that I'm going to mention, every person that I'm going to mention is aware of this, aware of what's happening. And this is why they say, well, there's no God, because they believe there's no comeback. The handlers have lied to them. The deities, the, the demons that are on the senior ones have lied to them. They have to lie to them. Um, and it's all ego-based, because they have no soul connection. They have no connection to higher beings. It's all ego-based. So everything's to do with... Um, making them feel good, making them feel superior, making them feel um, what they're doing is correct and there's, and there's a higher order of beings on this earth. And it's, and it's to do with either their bloodline, either to do with their connection to a group, or it's to do with how they are. They think that um, men are more superior than women. Um, and the class system was put in place and the caste system was put in place. Everything's been put in place in this civilization, and it's been drummed down to us that a certain group of people is higher or more important or more um, deserving of food, water, um, the basic standards even of life than others. Religion's been put in place is a great example of that. Okay, got what I was going to say. Yeah, so my family said, yeah, um, if I had, when the targeting started, if I, if I continued, was to be, to be broken by these beasts, um, if I was to join them, okay, this connection with my family would stop, in that correct family, forever. And not just this connection, um, if I was to turn into a child molester, um, this connection would stop. Is that correct, family? If I was to link myself in one of these beasts, um, romantically, and I keep talking, I think last time I said romantically, they keep fucking bringing these beasts around, um, disguised as humans, unaware, and they are fully aware, so fucking if that makes sense, that I can see the entities on them, even before I see the humans, I said this previously, it's their energy. Um, thinking that just their image alone, just their aura, just them, them being manly, that I'll go, ooh, quaking in my shoes, and ooh, all of a quiver. Without seeing that they're part of a group that are into child molestation, rape, Race disabuse, oh, race has got a big factor to play in what's going off in this as well. Because he's one of them and he's white, they're going to do everything in their power to protect him. Like I said right at the beginning, um, said this right at the beginning, the creature beast, they're doing this because he's one of them, they are one of them. So not just Paul Burgess, the convicted rapist, but Sylvia, whatever her surname and his partner. And the racists that were in the block as well. They're all racist, so you can't, you know, these are the worst type of creatures you could fucking imagine them to be. Worst type of people that you could, you could worse. And they're not um, charismatic in any way, he's not sophisticated. They can't socialise with other people. I'm saying this as a fact. They have no social skills, he has no social skills. The way he looks at a person, I've said this previously, as he looks at their uh, breasts, looks at their genitalia, um, 
and he stops and that's how or he looks right through you i've said this previously how this is how the rapist paul Bird just looks at women he has had a history of this okay and everybody involved knows that darby holmes know that darby city council my gps a various gp practice the one that's involved themselves in targeting because they've been told this program has been put in place um to control people because they, they know that the energies are shifting the energies are changing um and people are, you are going to see what what people are really like fuck their job titles you're going to see what these creatures are really like and it's going to repulse you instead of being scared you're going to be fucking repulsed is that correct family and they don't want that this is why it's all the conflicts in the world now it's the lower vibrations cause fears cause anxiety it's cause a, a negative reaction because that's how the creatures on them and the deities that they worship that they've linked themselves to that's their energy there's no love there's no loyalty there's no um, affection in any way shape or form is that correct family i think i'm going off on one i didn't even know what i was going to say yeah anyway so my family a few weeks ago um before the moon business um stated that um yeah we this was in place this was going to happen from when you were born is that correct family this contact was going to happen um, and some of you will will also have this contact happen in some way, shape or other. And it's been preset before you were born. Um, and another thing, um, the latest thing was that you've, I've been watched periodically throughout my life. Is that correct, family? So you get... Um, um, say um so you will get i don't want to say use the word guardian angels because there's loads of groups that they use your clan where your soul generated from and then there's other groups um where it's their job to watch over and there's people that you've been reincarnated on this earth with like your parents your, it could be your ch children your best friend whoever but it's somebody it will be somebody positive that you generally feel a heart connection to you're generally linked with not only these people you will be generally linked with soul connected to okay and it also depends on their behavior and how they have behaved on this earth um if they've still got that connection when they pass over but you will have people um watching over you even if you think i didn't think i had um people watching over me I didn't think I knew my granddad obviously existed um, and I can't remember him but I don't think he was one of them watching over me and he is okay um, I didn't think Wayne an ex-boyfriend and we were ex breaking up before he died um, and he got another girlfriend he had another child or he had a child um, I didn't think he'd be one of somebody that would watch over me, even though, sort of like, I remember saying this a few weeks ago, when he died, it was the first time I sort of praised, I never got down on my knees, but sort of prayed and wished there was a heaven, and wished there was, that, he's, that he was okay, and that he was, it was fine, and that he, wherever he was, that they wished there was a heaven, that there was something greater than earth for him. And he heard that, bless him. But yeah, um, and sort of the f day of his funeral, I heard banging. So I was getting my bathroom was downstairs at the time. Keep getting these notifications come up. Anyway, so my bathroom was downstairs at the time. I was getting ready to put my makeup on the day of his funeral, and um, I kept hearing banging upstairs in my bedroom. Really solid wardrobes. There's no way this banging could be coming from anywhere. Um, looked around there's nothing i've never heard it since i've never heard it from but I sort of like the sort of like banging 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 um so i knew that and i, I felt that to be wayne just letting me know that he was around that he was there um just to let me know that he was because we have talked about this that we had a disagreement regarding um Jesus and God and everything. Anyway, 
still yeah to let me know his whereabouts to let me know that he was still around and his soul um had moved on had had moved on and was still existing in another um dimension if you'd like so anyway this week i had and lately um wayne has always been around but it's not the person i've been really speaking to is that correct and my granddad has always been around and it's not the person i've been really speaking to so when you see me speaking and they're responding they have not been normally the person people their souls who i've been speaking to okay except for lately okay because of the targeting that's taking place i've said right at the beginning of this folks i'm not going to fucking bullshit and make out that i'm some um uh, forgiving angelic soul um i hate these creature beasts like i say it's a blanket hate for everybody involved in this because what they're doing to me is fucking so in, inhuman um and like i said when my family first appeared even before they appeared i sort of like sort of put it out there to the universe to fuck these creatures up um to smite them anybody knows what smite means go and work it go and look it up uh, i can't say because my things might cut off everybody involved and I sort of curse everybody that everybody be linked with Paul Burgess and the, the original racist and other sexual deviants involved in this right at the beginning for everybody to be linked to that energy to be linked to that rape to that rapist and racist okay um I didn't know until recently that there are factors in place higher beings in place that had the same um, thoughts had the same feelings feel the same anger regarding everybody that's involved in my targeting until recently okay my family um made it clear that um there is a council so they can't act um there's a plane flying a craft flying it's a craft see it's craft Try to zoom in as much as I can. And it's literally disappeared. Anyway, yeah. So my family made it clear this week, and when I sort of like hurry this on, um, that they, um, whoever made a request to the elders, I'm going to say elders for one of a better of a name um, for these creature beasts. Everybody to be that's been involved in my targeting, everybody that's been complicit. So there's going to be people at Derby Homes now that think it's another craft flying. Ever see it? That music in shot. Oh, um, that know about this. Who's having the right fucking jolly laugh? People that are watching me. There's another craft. Thank you, family. I don't know if it's Wayne. Is it? You can see it moving in different directions, back and forth. Okay, yeah, so they've uh, made it clear. So that's the original conscious circle I'm speaking to. Okay, so they have made it clear. Hold on. Just want to be clear. They've told me, um, and, it take, it, um, and it took sort of two years of me constantly having contact with my family, visual contact, for them to say, yes, everybody involved in your uh, targeting will be smited by us and the world of entity attachments and death is not the worst thing that could happen to anyone we think death because i was going you're going to smite them then you're going to smite them and i was like death is not the worst thing that could happen death is not the end this is not the worst thing that could happen to a soul okay 
Um, so it took two years for them to say yes, and they said yes, especially to do with Chief Inspector Jamie Hobday. They dislike him as much as I do, okay? And Chief Inspector Jamie Hobday is the main sort of like hands-on, on-the-ground police officer that's involved in my targeting, okay? Is that correct, family? And yes, I have seen him in Derby. I can give a description of what it looks like. Um, yes, he's the one I've told, I've, I've previously said that he's a child molester. And my family have confirmed it. And he's moved on to another child. I gave a description of what the child looks like. Um, and I've moved on, he's moved on to molesting another child because the other, the other child outgrew him. Is that correct, family? moving up and down okay and and they, they have meetings regarding the targeting uh, and they so the local authorities local authorities that are involved so at Dougley there would have been Dougley council members the housing officers the local MPs uh, the beast officers that are involved everybody okay um, the medical professionals so medical professionals at Dougley um, now I've moved to light, say it would be medical professionals at Dermot Medical Centre and blah, blah, blah. And if you look at the recordings, they, the creature we used to put in place have said this. Have said this, we're going to change your medical record and sort of like try to um, stop the treatment that you give and um, that you do receive, that I'm meant to have it received for about 10 years and one medical condition that I've got, um, which is standard care. Um, and they fuck themselves up because now I've moved. This is no way. This is like some per it's a, an accident, okay? Or oh, somebody's missed um, putting information into the system in incorrectly. That's not just one person's mistake. It's a catalogue and catalogue of the targeting. Anyway, all those involved. So my family said this week, yeah. That um, so after two years, I said yes, we are going to um, smite. the people that are involved in your target, including all the creature beast. So the ones that um, that you will see, that I will, I will show you that are on the street, the dregs of the dregs of the dregs, the piss heads, the racists, um, the sex offenders, the child molesters, I'm going to show you them, but it's also the people that are in offices behind and behind the job titles that know... Um, what's happening and doing nothing about it the local MPs um, because apart the system now and they've been lied to um, about what exactly this programme is and what happens to them when they're involved um, and they think they're more powerful and they're creative than God etc Okay, so my family have stated that recently it's come back to us another craft line But you see a green light, so it's a creature beast trying to outdo the crass with the pointy laser pen. This is how bad, this is how fucking thick these creatures are. Literally, this is how thick they are. Okay, so it's consciousness circle flying across the sky, changing colour, changing shape. You can see the building. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's lower. Now, I like to um, film the flying ones um, because you can see, nobody can say, okay. It's just a star, or it's just something, or they're not responding to what she's saying, and it's just, it's just coincidence. Look at me other videos if you don't believe me. Anyway, go back to this. I want to get, go back to this and make a point. Anyway, the point is finally, when she gets to it, she get points in the right direction. Here we go. 
Um, yeah, I've been told that everybody that's ever caused me harm, and I'm not, I'm not talking about um, human stuff, okay? That like getting into argument, you dislike someone. There's loads of people out there just who dislike me, who hate me. In fact, um, that have known me because something I've done to them, or just just taken a dislike to me. Um, I'm talking about people who systematically caused me harm um, throughout my life, okay? That I've never forgiven them for. Um, people that have since passed, like my father, anybody who knows me know who he is. Um, and he's a horrible human being. Okay, horrible human being. Okay, even though he's dead, he's being tortured now. Because not just what he's done to me, but what was, he's done to other people as well. Okay, so it's not just famous people that have caused harm to humanity and by their policies and what they've stood by, colonialism, slavery, etc. Um, but it's ordinary people that commit acts against people that are closest to them systematically throughout years and years and years who are also being tortured. Okay, it's not just me. This will happen um, because they're not human. I keep saying this and I keep want people to get it into their heads. People that act this way, you know, systematically over you and they cause troubles within the family to cause as much pain as possible. If they can get you to unlive yourself, to commit suicide, that's that's a big win for them. It's a shame that some people will know, listening to this, will know who I'm on about, will have people in their lives like this. That's a shame. Um, and then we'll say, yeah, these people are evil. They are pure evil. Okay, now imagine these people with fucking job titles. Imagine these people with people, with entities like them around them, going to them on and saying, yeah, that's okay, that's fine. This is how the world is now, it's not. Anyway, yeah, so long and short of it, they've told me, yeah, since we're born, um, people that have caused me intentionally harm over the long term, another person, it was my stepmother, fucking spilling all the tea now, aren't you, mate, who's still alive, I think, Sandra Woodward, and she's not going by, um, it's my married name, which would be, um, the family name that she's married to would be Sandra Campbell. Um, she's going to be tortured when she dies. There's going to be a lot, a lot of people um, that are going to, that have been told, and it's not just my wanting it, it's people that um, um beings and that have kin are connected to me that want this as well, that have commission this to the elders if you'd like like I say in vertical commas elders and elders have agreed woohoo it's going to be people at Derby Homes everybody that's been complicit the local MPs everybody that's been complicit and they've said to me as well they kept saying to me and they do say to me don't worry yourself you don't want you hear them in the fucking background look at listen to me audios don't worry yourself about these creatures we know everybody involved okay the settlement we know everybody involved and we will deal with them so from the delivery driver to the postman to the fucking taxi drivers to anybody that's been involved in the targeting me and that's and they will sort of try to um make light of what you say well i only did this or my boss says i had to do this um no matter, no matter how much or little they've done, they will be punished for their actions through beings without even being asking, but they have seen and they've sort of, there's been a, a meeting, it sounds fucking weird. Um, it's not as weird as I'm going to tell another story, I'm going to tell you another time. But actual meeting I attended, but that's another story for another time. Yeah, my family have said yes. And they've been, and it's been the commission, my people that have known me in this life, or my clan who I've never met, um, hi higher beings that see everything. So everybody at local authorities, everybody that's, the police officers that's been involved, the Freemasons at Dugley that's been involved, uh, local MPs at Dugley and now in this area, Dolly Abbey. Everybody that's been involved and everybody that continues to be involved will be punished for targeting me. 
that's a fucking long handed winded saying that I could have said that in a minute couldn't I folks 30 odd minutes later okay we did have a break when I showed you the frying consciousness circles or frying crafts I grant you but I could have said that in what less than a minute in that correct family and there was and it's and it's taken and it's taken with that there's another flying craft and it's been taken um without me yes i did say it right at the very beginning even before um this is what and this is what i mean about you don't know who you are before my family became involved before i knew they were involved the very soul of my being fucking cursed these beasts and and i, and I actually said if you ask them anybody involved in this you ask them what i said i said um that I would take this to the death. The, whatever happened in this life to anybody involved in the targeting um, is not enough. I would take this when we die, 300 years from now, I want to wanna make sure that they are being tortured for what they're doing. So there must be something in my consciousness for me to be aware of that, for me to say that this is not somebody... I call myself spiritual before. Um, um, a, a Gnostic Buddhist, I would say. But because they're so superhuman, this goes beyond any punishment that I could possibly imagine. And I did, how did I know that? Okay. And it's not just me this is going to happen to. It's not just me that got, I've got high beams looking out for you. Um, me. This is ordinary humans as well. And this is why I keep saying to you, you don't know who you are okay you don't know who you are connected to because in this life our our uh, the connection has been stunted has been called by the parasitic entities so you don't connect you don't feel that connection is that so family once you link yourself to these beasts that connection is gone completely you will never get back. You can't, on your deathbed, recant all your sins and say, oh, I'm very sorry, I didn't realise what was happening. None, none, none of the people that are involved had should sleep properly. Then I thought, no, fuck it. None of the people that are involved in my targeting will ever, ever be immune from the punishment, from their actions and the punishment that they're going to receive when they die. And part of the punishment is having the entity attachments on them already am i like my family um repeatedly say, stated they get the entity attachment because it's their energy in the first place they want to have these entities demons greys insectoids loads of insectoids different types of insectoids fucking horrible um on them in the first place if it wasn't part of their soul if their energy didn't um facilitate whatever entity attaches to them it's really difficult for that to happen, okay? So they're not like sex offenders, repeat sex offenders, they're not innocent victims, all this. Um, but if you are a um, person connected to high beings, um, there's a um, consciousness circle that just flashed at me, I just looked in that direction, it's flashed so well. <coughs> Cheeky cow, I am. Um, I forgot what I was saying. So if you're um, were linked, original energy was linked to the creator, because the grief, I said this previously, because the grief is stronger than you, they will override you and they will try to affect your mood so you get joy um, out of the suffering of others. And then there comes a point where you don't even, they don't even get joy out of that. Happiness doesn't belong to their energetic field. So even then, after a certain amount of time, no matter how much is closed, no matter how much their ego is stroked, they don't get any joy. There's, going to be, there's another fly in. Crap. Just to expand it. Oh, hi, family. I do get generally excited, so it's flying upwards now. I do get generally, let's see if you can see the, I suppose below, the, let's see it flying upwards. I do get generally excited when I see a flying craft or when I see my family. It's like the first time seeing them. Anyway, yeah, and you will break that connection. 
and I keep, that's why I keep saying you have a choice. Children know um, when they're doing things that are naughty, when they're being bad, okay? And there's going to be philosophers out there going, you've got to define that, and it's in that religious, religious context, and blah, 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 fuck off. People know what I mean when I say that. Children know, okay? So even if children know at a very early age, um, adults know. So no matter what anybody says to you, if they're your boss, if they're your lover, if they're your partner, if it's your best friend, if it's your mum, if it's your dad, or what, whoever it is, um, you know, especially if you have a heart connection, uh, yeah, especially if you have a heart connection, when whatever you're doing is bad or evil. Okay, so everybody involved, and they wanted me to say this, um, everybody involved, but I didn't want to, I sort of like, I don't know if it's false modesty. Oh, there's another craft line upwards. Busy it tonight, aren't it, folks? Okay, and before um, I log off, like I said, 10 minutes ago, I would. I like that, folks, it's disappeared. Woohoo! Okay, um... There we are. Um, so like I say, yeah, and this is, it's not a threat, it's not a warning, this is going to happen. And if you ask the people, inverted commas, whoever's involved in my target, your handlers will lie to you anyway. Is that correct, family? Your handlers are lied to you from the beginning and they will continue to lie to you, yeah. Okay, like the handlers, your handler, the handlers have been lied to. Like the royal families and the parasitic leaders have been lied to and it's so the demons on them can feed off them okay i forgot what i was going to say so did my family I'm going to end this there uh, and move on did my family say that that they are everybody connected to my targeting um no matter how much or how much little they've done will be punished or won't be tortured and like my family said right at the beginning death is not the end there's worse things than death and this is going to happen start happening it's already happened um, while they are still alive everybody that's completely that aware of this are doing fuck all about it and um, that could do and all you have to do I might say you fucking come marching on the fucking council buildings marching to Simon Foster's office or home or wherever it fucking rest and do this but if you if you can your displeasure to what's happening goes a far way um and not getting involved with these creatures goes a far way even if i don't want to get involved too boss I don't want to get involved that's it just leave me out of it and don't giggle with them and don't laugh at them and don't look in do you want to see how the nigger sleeps She's going to the toilet now. Let's see how the nigger um, gets to the toilet. She's up in the shower. Let's see her in the shower. And that affects, and that has affected people, not just in my um, circle. This is people that I've watched on the internet. So many people on the internet, especially to do with the targeting. Um, and like I said, about the beginning, I was watching people that I believed were sincere in their contact with UFOs that were spiritually in their, in their awakening, um, black, white, you, whoever, okay? Um, and there were some people that try to, like Comte Kennedy, that makes it a point of sort of like saying, oh, this place, if I say, if I was to say egg and chips, you can guarantee in that week she would bring up egg and chips. If I was to say um, flowers are cool, you can guarantee a next fucking pose with flowers, of course, you do anything to, and it's, and it's trying to make you paranoid, it's trying to make you seem, is that correct, family? And I will go on, and I will name her, um, and I want you to sh I'll show you how much they will do to make themselves appear to be decent, normal human beings, and she's far from it. People are still being sick, and they don't know why they're being sick when they watch her video and then feel okay afterwards. Is that correct, family? 
and the reason they're feeling sick, the reason they are being sick because they can see the insectoids on her, they can see the other entities on her. Is that correct family? Okay, and this is, and, and this is what I mean about um, the sending these geezers. Um, thinking I found them attractive and forget about the entities I can see on them. And, oh, you're gorgeous. And that's another way to um, control me. So they block all communications. If they can block anything that could help me in any way, they've, they've blocked it. And this has been right from the beginning. This is the police. West Bengals police right from the very beginning. So I contacted so many different um, agencies, so many different solicitors. Um, and sending emails is just out of questions because they're just they're on to my on my system on the various computers. I've just I'm not going to say what I've just seen. Very quick, and it's been um, there's a massive. I'm going to say this. I hope my family conf will confirm it. There is a massive, massive craft that's cloaked itself, invisible in my eye line. Is that correct, family? like a mother craft so when you see the consciousness circles or the smaller crafts suddenly appearing and disappearing they are disappearing onto that mother craft is that correct family that's my theory is that correct family okay so back to it um about to post about racism and this racist who I knew was racist, but I could see the light on him, around him, because they've cultivated that, and they, and because oh, there's another craft, oh, it's brighter this time. What's our craft? There's another one. Let's see if it gets in shot. Here we go. Okay, could man made craft move like that? You see it flashing just red there, um, but it was red and green. Or teal, not the colours, which I don't. Okay, I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, racist. Um, I said previously um, regarding the race issue. Um, I've never been racist. I've been. I've grown up in areas, and where I've always been surrounded by sort of um, black, white, Asian, multicultural areas, if you'd like. Okay, um, and like I said, I want my foster parent. One of my foster parents was. I was in an Asian household, okay. I can remember, and who and the father in that in that household had a, a positive impact in the way I view men, in the way I what I expect from them. Not my father. So I'm going to talk about psychiatry, um, and next time where well, most of it is shit. But if you are connected, but also want to talk about um, if you are connected to your clan, you will know from the get go how life you'll see life how it is and how it shouldn't be this way and and that when people are wrong even if it's your parents you don't feel an attachment to them because um they're your parents um if the fucked up you knew can you know the fucked up i never swore when i was younger not to hit the teenage years um but i knew my parents were fucked up so he wasn't a, he wasn't an example my father wasn't an example that looked to up to person or I even liked or loved okay even though he was my main carer for some periods of my life okay he was I could see that he was a horrible man so even at a young age even though I didn't have the vocabulary right now 
for certain things or for certain words and emotional um, responses and how I felt and how the other person's behaviour was wrong, I knew there was wrong. So there's another thing as well. You will know, you won't follow the crowd, if you're, especially if you're attached to uh, high beings. You will know this from a child. Okay, things that you will know, you don't act if they have no frame of reference of why you know things are fucked up or, or why you know people are wrong. And you don't hold it, um, you don't blame yourself, you don't think, oh, is everything I've done, you just know people are fucked up. And you will know them this from a very early age. Is that correct, family? And not just people, the world around you, the way it's being, the way it's being run, um, the civilization you live in, you look at other cultures and you know that there's a difference between cultures, are just that, it's just differences. It doesn't make them better or, or worse than you, no matter what culture you, you may live in. Okay, racism. Quickly moving on. I might, uh, yeah, so this guy, uh, Facebook group, friends known him since I was little I did actually mention him about he's one of the people that had a um an energetic attachment to him that was from the creators he was connected to higher beings okay is that correct family or oh, he had the potential to be connected to higher beings okay the creature beast have worked on him and I've said I didn't believe that because he was a racist these are racist I um, his tweets, his Facebook post, I'd say he's, on, he's a knockdown stand up racist. If that's a phrase, I'm making it one. Okay? Just because somebody um, likes one culture that's different from their own doesn't mean, um, and they're not racist, inferior to that culture, it doesn't mean um, makes them less of a racist. Okay? So this guy. Um, because the, I know that, um, and it's humans that got to him, okay, and I've said, you know, yeah, do you know, yeah, she said this, she means you when she, when she says that, and you know that she means you. Right, if you can do this and do this, and they would have convinced him, got inside his head, got inside his ego, um, to write and to post as many racist posts as possible, okay? Is that correct, family? And because they can't get to me, they're trying to um, get to people that know me through Facebook who went to school. There's another craft line, shall I film it? Will you pick it up? Yeah, we'll film it. I don't know if you can see it. Has it gone by? Has it gone by? It's gone by. Okay. So I'm going to end on this one. Okay. I keep saying that these parasites feed off hate. Is that an all negativity, racism, um, and colonialism, and nationalism um, was created by these parasitic entities, and it's always been in this civilization. Is that correct? When you post hate, when your heart is is of hate. That's what you're going to attract. That's the energies, that's the entities that's going to attract to you. Okay, so in the matter of a uh, few short months, and it's increasing, actually. So we had it before, we had it months and months ago, but I didn't say anything, I let things ride. Um, he now, from not having anything attached to him, demons, insectoids, grey, whatever, now, because his, his convolt is... Um, um, cultivated so much hatred it's cultivated so much energy around him that the entities around him are going to feed off that and link themselves to him okay so that the entities at one hand and then you've got the um, handlers it, and he will have handlers saying to him do this and yet so many people start liking your post and blah 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 say about silence you can refugees and think about us first and us in this country first and um and the peas are, co are coming over here are taking our jobs driving our kids to school etc etc i can't go nowhere to eat look i filmed them i filmed them and you know i can't go to a cafe and i'm surrounded by them okay 
he knows who he is and anybody's seen the post in my Facebook, Facebook group will know who he is and I'm using him as an example he will never recover from that never recover and the more he does it the more he goes into hate the more entities will attach themselves to him is that correct family and it's all to feed his ego all to feed whatever and it's the same age as me so i can't i can't like, show someone is the same age you think i oh, could fucking grew up in the same area mate there's no need for you to be such a hardcore, disgusting racist. Because you aren't even alive. You, you've grown up with, with black, white, Asian people around you. And they'll try to say they're not racist because, like, how can I be racist? I've got black friends. Um, if you I'm telling this one black person to another, okay, between us, white people, mind your business for a minute. Okay, if you've got a friend who is white, um, or the same ethnicity, ethnicity as you are, or different, now if you've got a friend, if you're black and you've got a friend who's white who talks about, you are oh, all right, but it's them lot, whether they mean um, refugees, Eastern Europeans, um, Asians, um, you can guarantee if they could a, a drop us a hat, They'd be calling you nigger as well. They'd be calling you wog. They'd be calling you coon. They'd be calling you monkey. Okay. Um, just like Heather Ak Akiyemi did um, towards me. And Heather Akiyemi is a white woman I was friends with. Um, we, need, we didn't have a falling out, but she's part of this targeting programme now. Okay. Akiyemi is an African name. She was married to an African man. This is about 50 years ago, okay? She's got black kids, black misraised kids, and black grandchildren, okay? And the reason why that she's involved in my targeting because she didn't change the voice. If you look at Mr. Miyoda, she didn't change her voice. And she was so eager to call me a black nigger, to be involved in this and call me a black nigger without first switching a switch or on the audio to disguise a voice that heard it was her. Is that correct, family? Okay, now she's a white woman that's got black kids, has um, surrounded itself in Jamaican culture. Um, like I say, had a black uh, African husband, have had black boyfriends in the past, a kids, different fathers, been black. But as soon as she could, as soon as she got the opportunity, the calling me black, she's calling me black bastard without realising. And she's so eager to do it, it must be the start of a shift. I think I said the previous, it must have been the start of a shift where she couldn't, she didn't change the voice on, on the fucking audio. So it was her voice I heard. And then she must have realised, switched, and then switched to switch or whatever the fucking do on the audio. Let's go back to changing the voice altering the voice so I don't know who it is. Is that correct family? Conversely, white people you can step in there. Okay. Um there's gonna be I know people that um are white who haven't got a racist bone in the body, um, but have no black friends, have a few black acquaintances, depends on where they live in the world, but I know because just of just law of averages and who they are. I've even had white friends that they are not racist. Okay. And for me, the deep down um, issue with racists, they th think they are superior. For them to feel um, any superiority regarding another's race, for them to direct whatever issues they are having in their life to an outside group without them actually researching what's been going on and why there's apparently an influx if there is an influx first in one group of um, refugees or asylum seekers or or the windrush, windrush generation or things like that before them researching things like that it's very easy to to blame a religion 
So 9-11 with the, the, the sort of Muslims, Muslims, and, and they'll make the excuse it's Muslims, it's Muslims. They have to direct the hate somewhere. Like I say, if one person, if you know somebody that hates one group, of, one group, but they say you lot are okay, fucking avoid them like the plague. And like I said previously, the reason why racism is such rampant in the targeting programme um, is because the original people of Earth were dark skinned, had a hue to their skin tone. Shall I go on more? And I'm going to pick, the up, pick this up why um, at a, a later date because I've gone on for about an hour now and I'm just bloody hell. So there's a reason why and it's always been that certain people um certain cultural groups have always been targeted and if you go through the history and not just black history look at irish history look at um i can't think of a group i was going to say italian but italians um or, or linked to the creator. People with a hue to their skin tone will be linked to the creator, more likely to be linked. And like I said previously, look at people in the organisations and the sites in the society, sorry, um, that have been targeted. That be um mass genocide have been committed regarding their people, the American Indians. There's a reason why the certain groups have been targeted of just see that. As a flash. I was just about to sing there, showing that flash glory. Flash. Uh, da, 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 da. I don't know. Rest. That's all I know. Two words. Anyway, so there's a reason why um, certain organisations and, and why it's been cultivated by racism and why um, sexual deviants have, have been cultivated in, in societies today. But like I said, that person um, didn't have an entity attachment. Is that correct, family? Okay, but now, I've just moved it to the centre, but now he has entities, I should say. He's got more than one. I'm saying like entities, parasitic entities, demons, greys, whatever, negative parasitic beings that have no connection to the creator whatsoever. And all they had to do was whisper in his ear, so to say this, write this. And he will get a buzz as well out of sending these posts, writing these posts, because that's what they do. At first you will get... Um, will make you feel really happy and really like you're buzzing literally like you're buzzing because they have to keep you and they have to you have to be open to them and to them is is their handlers their um and whatever entities are around them give it a year and all you're going to see from him is hate that's what happens with everybody i've noticed me fucking targeted since 2020 20, is it 2014? And right at the beginning, like I said, um, at the beginning, the, the buzzing, you can tell people are buzzing, you can tell people that are new to it because they'll be buzzing. And then after a while, um, and it's happening quickly and quickly, um, quickly and quickly. Fucking hell. Okay, it's happening more um, quicker than when it first started, when I first noticed entities on people, that it's happening in a very short amount of time. In a very short amount of time. They need to feed. They need, they, the parasites, need to feed. It's all about harvesting because the energies are changing now and the harvesting and getting attached to as many people as other frying craft as possible.
from last set um, previously. Um, and I wasn't going to bring targeting, rock targeting into it. And then the family says, no, bring targeting into it. What's happening to me overtly and covertly will happen, is happening now to everybody. All you've got to do is look at a politician's lying. All you've got to do is turn on your TV. Okay, so we'll talk about racism and why, and why, even though I'm seeing this, um, and they know I'm linked to high beings, and they know, they don't know who these high beings are, they just know them as high beings. So handlers have told them that, um, yeah, we know who you are, we know who they are. They don't, they, they, that's just, this is why they use the dregs of society. Okay, so this has been going on for a very long time before I was born on this civilization. Um, my family have also contacted other beings, other people, other humans on Earth. Not just in the not just in this time frame, but hundreds of years ago, there's always been people that have had this contact with UFOs, um, lights, whatever you want to call them. And all the, the people at the top um, know that they're more powerful than they are. So that's why they deny it. That's why they put um, a fake UFO expert in place. Okay, but this has always happened. Um, I forgot what I was going to say now. I think that's enough. But like I say, with the racism, I will come back. Um, back onto that another time. Like I say, like you've heard them. Yeah, I'm, I'm back. I know what I was going to say. The um, so the drugs and these are pissheads. These are these are the local um, racists. These are not sophisticated people. They're not MR5. Yes, some of them like the MPs in line that connected to the Freemason. Is that correct? Okay, the Freemason is not an organizing organization. You should be scared of. They want you to be fearful of them. Oh, the secrets they know about the earth. And like I said previously, all the secrets that they've ever been given have been given to them by the parasitic entities so that parasitic entities can guide them and feed off their ego. Is that correct? That's what I keep saying. I'm not going to say anymore. Um, if you are a Freemason, get out. Because I guarantee your Beastmaster um, is not going to tell you the full story why this is happening because they don't want to it's, it's energies, it's beings that are more powerful than themselves this is why they have to go through other people this is why the entities can't attack us directly or the world, it would be no use for them so that's why they attach themselves to people that are disconnected from their soul disconnected from the, their creator and get them to do the work of the power this is why I say about narcissists, I hate the term fucking narcissist, but sadist, various forms of sadist are involved. Because they're not human. That's why we call them sadists, because they, they like inflicting pain on others just to get joy from it. And if they could hide behind the job titles of who they are, all the better, especially if they can fool you as well, like I say mocking humanity go back to Simon Foster and the reason why yeah, I could say bring it up to talk to you, I wasn't going to I was going to separate the two things um, but because it's happening to all of us literally all you've got to do is turn on your news um, read any media reports you are being targeted we are being lied to okay um, and I want people to realise just how pre prevalent Prevalent, prevalent, widespread, fucking hell, um, this is, and how long it's been going off, and all we have to do is not give them the energy, not pay attention to them, don't let ourselves get wind up by them. They need our emotions, our negative emotions to feed. Okay, so... 
this is why racism and blah 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 was created okay so it feeds their ego of whatever human they're using is that correct and in turn um whatever entity is on them gives them the energy it gives them the buzz And this is a pre. This is just a pre. Um, a prehensitive chat, if you'd like. Okay. When the guys post new things of God and Simon seekers, um, and surrounded by them, etc., etc., they don't know. They listen. The people enjoying the food, mate. How how they're gonna know what you think? Do you think they care what you think? When asylum seekers come into the country because it, it's been um, policy, because to get a better life and blah, blah, blah. Eastern Europeans coming to work in the UK because it's policy. That, and if you don't like it, instead of attacking the people, the poorest, why don't you attack the politicians? Why don't you go, blah, 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 this is their policy, this will be brought into place? Because they know that dumbasses. Um, are not going to do their research and going to carry on their hatred. Okay, I think that's not, yeah, so I'm going to talk about racism and how, okay, regarding this, what's happening with this, I used to say I was quite liberal in my thinking. I am still quite liberal, liberal um, but I am not a liberal, so I'm not linked to the Labour Party. <laughs> no way am I linked to the Labour Party. Um, and my views on certain issues have changed dramatically. Do you know, even though I can't say a word, folks, highlight for a moment, um, sometimes, because I'm, I'm, I'm in pain now, so I'm talking to you, and because I'm knackered, and I'm having a womanly glow moment, a womanly glow moment. Um, I know, family, I am aren't I? I'm in pain, I'm very tired. I'm having a moment of glowingness. Glowingness. You can have that, folks. Women of a certain age. Don't say, oh, you got, you're got flushing. You're not hot flush, are you, dear? Say the glowingness. You're glowing. That'd be nicer. Anyway. Yeah, I forgot what I was going to say. Train of thought's gone. But I've said what I'm going to say. Um, and we'll go on to um, why... Um, it's kind of a fear feed off or sexual deviance okay um, and I've changed my viewpoint on certain issues when my family have come involved um, I've argued with them um, rejected things that they've said and this is another thing that you know that you, the creator doesn't care so just because I disagreed with them and said something regarding, well, in this part of civilization, all right, fine, people think like this, don't think like that. I'm thinking, who the fucking hell I was speaking to? Who, who am I? Okay. Um, so there's certain things that I won't say, and there's certain things I am going to say because it's so prevalent. <laughs> Bloody hell. Um, within society, and because of what's happening to me. So the black white um people that are different especially um as people are going to be the, the fostering um mixed relationships now okay that's not to do with any positivity one little bit okay and there's a guy on i don't know i keep saying okay now there's a guy on the internet ginger hair fat fuck Looks like he's in his 40 with a black girl who looks like she's in her 20s. Two kids. He's a racist as fuck. He's a racist into folks. Into family. Okay, racist as fuck. And I think he did a little skit where it says, uh, and, and the singing and the dancing, it was like, why, um, why am I with a black woman with two kids? And he's singing, because I like it. Okay, the point of putting racist with um, or linking racist romantically, especially if the person's white, especially if the male's white, um, with a black woman, especially a black woman, um, is because she's more likely to be linked to the creator. 
And because she's got kids as well, he can break, he's going to get off with torturing them kids. He's getting off torturing those kids. Psychologically, oh, they'll put the lights on in that building. Let there be light. Okay, go back to it. Okay. Um, is that correct, family? Okay. And it's not just black, as in Caribbean, or ethnic groups around the world. So you're going to find... Um, if you know in New Zealand, the native Kiwis and, and what's propagandised in there would be sort of like the white population or if you're Asian, getting, this, getting with a white guy, English. And the reason it's not as a positive race, they all get on, they are still racist as fuck, okay? Because they have to feel superior, and there's going to be black people involved in this, um, and they're going to use the excuse, "Well, we can't be racist because there's black people involved." Do you know how many coons have sold them, sold themselves out, knowing the part of the system? Because they've been told the part of the system, and I keep saying this isn't a black and white thing. But as for the targeting program is concerned, um, they will target a specific group of people. And if you're um, with a hue to their skin tone. Okay. And the people on there will say, well, I can I be racist? You know, how can he be racist if he's married to a black woman or going out with her or whatever? How can he be racist? It's to break them. It's to make her so submissive and so disconnected from source that she doesn't connect. And I'm not going to say that it's going to happen. Uh, it won't happen to black people as well. So they send a black guy in um, with a, a black guy, an Asian guy with an Asian guy, the same ethnicities together. But if the guy, and it's going to be especially the guy, um, is linked to the system linked to the targeting programme or just linked to the system just generally he'll be told to have, a, have that relationship and to break them so they're never happy happiness, joy is the number one hate because it's linked to the creator that energy, that those energies a sense of contentment, a sense of peace is linked to our creator it's not linked to their creature you say they can do anything in a small way to a very grand way where it affects countries um, wars to to personal relationships they will do that and that's always been put in place but I've noticed since being targeted for fuck's sake um, the hatred of black people is hard it's, it's really hardcore um Everybody that's been... I've just look at, listen to some recordings. I can't tell you how many times we've called black nigger or monkey. At the very beginning of this, just call me. I think, And this was police officers. At, right at the very beginning, when this started, it was Westminster police, office, police officers who call me black beauty. I don't like people using, you know phrases but um it's always in sexual man it's always been sexual and it's always there's always a race element to it always this, this is part of it a race element is the, okay so there's going to be um and it's all to do with control all to do with control and to break your spirit to break you down to stop that connection like I say, um, I used to, my views um, on mixed relationships, like I say, Wayne's white in this civilization before he died. He was white. So this ex-boyfriend um, that we cared about each other, we loved it. Didn't we love each other? We, call it, we would never love each other. I'm not a love each other kind of person. Um, so I'm not saying um, all white people are this, all white people are that, but if, if they connect to the system, you can guarantee race is a big factor and why this is happening now. 
gender is a big factor on what is happening now. And they are going to say um, sexual deviance is a big factor of what is happening now. And all those three things, all these things that they hate, it's all these things that I'm very proud of being. I'm very proud of being a woman. That confirms what, um, where I'm talking to and what, um, what's happening at the moment. But I'm very proud of being a woman. Um, I'm very proud of being um, black. And in this civilization, um, being Jamaican. Okay, very proud of being working class. So the things that they try to knock you um, and on, or the things that try to break you on, it's, it's. I've gone off topic. Yeah. Okay. So one of the things they've said as well. So very proud of all that. Okay. So the things that try to knock me on, they never, they haven't knocked me on. Um, and I can't tell you, like I said, there's so many coons out there that are part of the system that have literally, not just Desmond Dajou, um media, pop stars, um, actors, you name it. But they will spout pro-black things. Like Desmond Dajou said he was a um, community acti activist now. Um, before it was a race activist. He now was a bishop. Um, and like I say he would have told the families that have been that family members that have been murdered by the police after speaking to them that he would have said now pray let's pray okay and he would have got such a laugh they would have got such a, a kick out of everything that he's done his contact with them saying yeah I've done this I've done that this is what you should do next okay let's pray and this is somebody that's not linked to the creator at all. The very opposite. Complete opposite. Um, and like I say, one of the things I keep fucking going on, don't I? Um, but I'm going to go back. I'm going to stop here for now. Let's see another craft. Um, and then I'm going to go back and explain about the race. And it's nothing to do. And I keep saying this. Um, with... Oh, there's another craft. I think it's just do it across, just noticed it. Okay, um, it's nothing to do with what race you're born into in this civilization. Okay, it's to do if you're part, if you're human or a parasite, simple as that. Okay, if you're a human being or you're a parasite that needs to feed, if you're a sadist to a varied degree, to various degree, if you linked yourself to these entities and there's no going back there's no going back you can't on your deathbed go oh my bad sorry please 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 god don't let me go to hell or whatever they do i don't know what to do okay but so the part the targeting and they will target specific people like i say the reason why i talk to me i'm going to end with this um is because to protect the rapist is to protect Paul Burgess. Everything, um, right from the beginning, most of the things have been sexual in nature, like I said about infant rape. They love talking about infant rape because they know the reaction, that how it affects me, okay? They love talking about child rape. Um, you've heard the rape threats of that, and why don't you strangle her and pretend that she likes it like that? And these have come out of the rain mouth. That's come out of the rain mouth. That's quite. Why don't you strangle and say she likes it like that? Say David said that she likes it like that. She likes being strangled. So even in their in their um, from the very beginning with this stuff fantasies of the rapist. So he did try to kill me. That he, they were planning to kill me. Everybody, everybody. From the beginning, was aware of this. Okay. And because, like I said, he's one of them. To let him continue to do that, knowing that he's a rapist, convicted rapist, knowing that he's had a history, long history, of violence against women, knowing it is not charismatic in any way, shape, or form, knowing his hatred towards women is palpable, literally palpable. 
knowing that he's a racist he ticks all their bosses for that so all ticks all the boxes for them so there's one of us and black female on the room and blah 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 so yeah i want to say um regarding and the truth um how i've changed and how my viewpoints have changed and um, some of them is to do with the targeting regarding having relationships and who you have your relationships with um and some of it to do with what my family have told me and like i can like i keep repeating and repeating say it's not to do with your dna per se it's to do with who you are linked with who you link your energies with So even if they're involved in a targeting program, they're not. If you're involved in a system, in the system. If they were involved in the system, they will try anything to, on a very personal level, so your personal relationships to, on a, on a grander worldwide stage level, to break people or a group of people who are connected with the Creator. I'm going out. Thank you for that, family. End on that. But the way it win, they've lost. I keep saying this, they've lost. Literally, they have lost. Their deity, that one of the deities that they worshipped is dead. I've got fucking arm mate now, please. Sorry swearing. I'm not sorry for swearing. Just think to say lately. So I've had to mute for that round. None of the people um, that are involved in my targeting have lost it. Let me go back. Here we go. I'm gonna, none of the people that are involved in my targeting um, is a human being. They have, they have no soul um, connection. If they did, um, it's only a matter of time before that the connection to energetic higher beings that created mankind, created the earth, for that connection to be broken. Okay, if you're a sex offender, a serial sex offenders, they are not linked to the creator, they're not linked to humanity. That's why they're being tortured. And they're being tortured, bless them, sick fucks, by the very entities, by the very energetic force that they link their energy to. Like I say, people involved in my targeting, um, you've got an insectoid on you, you've got demons on you because you've linked yourself to the targeting programme. And like I say, I wasn't going to bring targeting, I was going to separate the two. Um, no rain is expected today. You're right. I do a lot of Amazon shopping, folks. Okay. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. I was a trailer for. It's not to do with your DNA or your ethnicity. I just say DNA. Put it short. But there's certain groups that are more easy to manipulate than others, shall I say. But like, always, like I've also mentioned, I'll keep mentioning, the black people involved in this, the Asian people involved in this, my targeting, I should say. Um, any nationality you can think of will be involved in this. To a various degree, okay? If somebody is a sadist and they are um, Jamaican, if they're a sadist, they're a sadist. If they're a rapist, they're a rapist. Anybody that shows you um, the, the narcissistic, hate the word, um, nature, that they like causing pain to others, it's not to do with race. So I keep this one hand, um, I want to explain it a bit better next time. Um, 
it's not to do with race. And then next stand, par um, par I can't say the word. I forgot what the word is. Paradoxically, yay. Paradoxically, um, because of the people or the entities that are involved in the programme, um, a racist fuck. So the dregs of society, the dregs of the solar system. Oh, yeah, that's something I wanted to say as well. Okay, the people that are involved um, in the targeting programme, okay, the, the sadist of this world, the humans, they are the dregs of the solar system. Okay, and my family said this right at the very beginning that they're not human. Anybody involved in the targeting programme are not human. I'm not right, family. They are literally not human. So, they have no connection to source, no connection to God. Break it down, they have no soul. Their, their spirit has been linked to um, parasitic entity, entities and demons. So, yeah, so I wasn't going to really talk into it, but now I am, just to illustrate to you what, what I'm talking about. So, um, so I am going to bring it in, because I thought, why should I? And the family said, bring it in. Bring it in, make an example, show examples. So, the family, so yeah, that's what, this is why I'm going to bring it in. Um, and say, yes, when they call me in, they go, bitch. Um, and in the same breath, they say, join us. Or um, trying to induce feelings of like or lust towards a delivery person or somebody um, that's connected to them. And they, they haven't got the intelligence to know I don't know what the thing, I don't, I, do you know, I'm going to go into it in a different time, but like I said, I don't know um, the level of stupidity and lack of self-awareness regarding these people. And they will have meetings about what they're going to do next. These people, like it's saying, um, that connected to my targeting, these people are police officers, Chief Inspector Jamie Hopday being the man of the ground, these are GPs, these are health professionals, these are local authorities, Derby Council, Derby Homes, Douglas Council. Okay. And the reason why they use the dregs and the people, if they, there is profession, if there is um, professions, get it right, that are in contact, they're, they're, part of their job is to have contact with the general public. That's the people they're going to use as well. They have used. Okay. I think I'm too tired to go on now, but hopefully various subjects rambling on. Gonna st gonna start as I meant to start. And as I meant to you know what I mean folks, very tired, in pain. Okay. My family um told me uh, right at the very beginning that things have been put in place so the people that everybody that's been involved with my targeting um everybody that are complicit in the targeting um will be punished it doesn't matter how much or how little you've done you will be connected to the energy of the rapist and the group as a whole and saying um well, my boss told me to do this, or X, Y, and Z told me to do this. It's not going to be a get out, a phrase that you can use. Is that correct, family? You know it's wrong. Everybody involved know it's wrong. Everybody involved knows that it's wrong, that it's human. I'm sure there's a craft that keeps um, literally, as I'm speaking, there's a craft that keeps literally uncloaking itself and cloaking itself very, very quickly. And it's the mother craft. Is that correct, family? Is that correct?
different. I'm like, there's a muffle craft that I'm looking at, but it's because it's cloaked. I can't, I can't see it too clearly unless the literally a millimetre of a second it sort of flashes, uncloaks itself, and then cloaks itself. Is that correct? Did I just see? Yeah, so go back to the point, you know, and that's what they told me that this meeting, um, and they went to the elders. I'm using the term elders because I've got no other phrase for it, um, to petition, if you'd like, that everybody that's involved in my targeting will be punished. And the punishment is starting now, it's not going to start when they die. Um, and part of the punishment is to let them continue because I kept saying, I kept saying, you're going to smite the beast, this is right at the beginning, you're going to smite them, family, smite them all. And it says, no, um, there's things worse than death um, and just let them to continue don't try to block them but let them continue the more people get into this the more the energy um, portals are made that links them to the, the, the abyss or wherever these negative creatures come from okay so that's my family said right, let them let them continue as another fine cloud craft okay let them continue in that correct family and it's their actions that's going to be partly to blame for the torture the, the tor they're going to be tortured anyway by the entities on them okay um, and this is not just not just me that's what I keep saying people um, you don't know who you are linked to don't let fear some parasitic fuckwit no matter what their job title, try to scare you. Because you don't know who you are linked with, you don't know the powers um, who you are linked with. And they will use fear or sex as a way to get you in, as a way to break you. Fear or sexual deviance, I should say. And this could happen with both, both male and females as well and this is also can happen with anybody if you're connected like I said previously um, if you've got a family member that's passed or loved one that's somebody that you're connected to emotionally um, this is the time where they're going to be watched if, not, if they've not been reincarnated you can guarantee if you're going through shit you are not alone your family member is there beside you Okay. Not just your family members, going to be entities that you don't even know that you are connected to, who are more strong, um, a more warrior in their approach to down the shit ain't going to go down like that. Okay, this is this is what I mean. I keep saying, I keep banging on about this because it's so important. Link to your heart energy. Link to your heart. And don't let the fact that um, these parasites will use their job title to get to you. They will um, try to change the way you think, the way you feel. They will use fear. To get to you, to get inside you, into, into your energy, so you so you break, so you're anxious. They don't want you to connect with the energies coming in. Because the energy is coming in, will link you to your clan. And if you've got a family member that's passed, the energies that are coming in now are going to be even stronger. So that deck, that connection is going to be even stronger. Is that correct, family? You have more people protecting you than you realise, than I realise. I didn't know. Um, um, yeah, we know that because they actually fall out with people as such, um, quite easy going sometimes. Um, so we never, we never fell out. So me and Wayne never fell out, even though we split up, never fell out. And I still had, um, it was really upsetting when he, when he died, when he passed. Um, and that's why I wished him well. I wished there was a heaven. First time I've prayed, but I never got down on my knees. But you know what I mean? I sort of wished that he was okay. 
and all wished that um, there was heaven and that it was, it was, it, it was safe. And like I say, had the banging sounds in the wardrobe where I used to live and the day of his funeral when I was getting ready. There's no way that Buggy could come from anywhere where I used to live. Okay, so this is the time um, where you are protected. If you've got family members that have passed, friends, etc., that have passed, um, and there's a genuine love between the two of you, you can guarantee, if they've not reincarnated, that they're watching your back. They and they see a lot more than what we see. They know what's happening a lot more um, clearly. Um, I know the intentions of a person, of a group, clearly, more clearly and more accurately than what we see. Another thing before I go. So next time I'm going to mention race, okay? How I've changed um, my viewpoint on that and give you examples um, why certain, especially fucking out these podcasts, um, these black guys... Um, literally dragging black women left right center um on why that's happening and why i can guarantee you these po these podcasts and these black guys just dragging women or dragging black women um the handlers like it will be white i guarantee you that and all because they want their ego fed they want the viewing and they get a buzz um out of the views and people paying attention it's feeding their ego and these social commentators. There's a reason why um, sexual deviant is so prevalent, prevalent in this civilization. Why rape? And they could stop it easily. The police force, the politicians could stop it so easily. Okay, I've broke my body, folks. By leaning, I've just literally broke my body. <sighs> okay, I mean, I haven't literally broken it. It's a phrase. But I'm in pain. Great deal of pain. That's right, probably. So, yeah, I'm going to talk about race um, and how it's not to do with your DNA if you're connected. But part of the targeting program, part of this parasitic edge to this program. Um, is to break humanity and if they can link um, oh god I literally I fucking break my body let's go back and if they can link um, somebody that's connected somebody that's human and they can see they know who's glowing or not okay folks if they can um, link you with somebody having um, also a partner, somebody that's come into their life, um, especially because and and they would would have recorded the sex lives of these people as well. By the way, okay, sex is so, because they've got nothing else. It's the that's the highest energetic frequency in the human form these creatures to feed off it. I was going to talk about the entities okay, I've said this previously so I'm going to go into about race I'm going to about um, how it's not black. It's not a black and white issue um, it's to do with humans um, and parasitic beings the demons, the entities, the greys the insectoids And like the person of the same people of said social group, race, um, one of them can be um, a sadist to a various degree. Um, it's not just one group that is a part of this. Like I say, black, white, you name it, it's a rather part of it. Um, and the, f the featuring of mixed couples, that's, that's, that's a better term for it, yes mixed couples is done not in a positive way and it's done by the parasitic entities is that correct 
this order to break um, the connection of whoever in that coupling has with the creator. If you're constantly anxious about your partner um, not liking something or berating you or gaslighting you or your family members doing it I can't be asking that folks I'll tell you the truth I'm just going on um, so I'm gonna, and I'm making so I'm going to finish this and I'm gonna, hopefully I'll remember to start where I left off going on, going on about um, this new fandled social mixed relationship advertising it's not done in a positive way it's not being done in a positive way whatsoever and I've just seen I've seen loads of different things there's a craft that's close to self um, keep saying that folks don't I? but it's completely different from the, the mother craft and it's black before I'm going to ask my family that family did I just see um, a craft suddenly reveal itself or then on reveal on cloak itself thank you okay I'm going now folks I've broke my body and I've stopped swearing unnecessarily Thank you, family. For now, folks, didn't want this to go on as long as it had, but way while I'm here. I've just rambled on about different subjects, but I hope it makes sense. Um, and like I say, if I'm being protected, um, if people um, that I've had known in this life, even if I can't remember my granddad, um, my clan have gone to the elders and have requested um, the people that involved in my targeting to be punished, um, to be tortured, and that torture to be stopped in this life um, and this, um, this is what my family says oh don't you know let them carry on the more pe these creatures do the more entities and the more powerful the entities will be attached to them because they've opened themselves up to this portal to the um, parasitic the demons the greys the longer as they're involved, um, soon as they're involved, that's it. The handlers and the bosses won't tell them that because this is harvesting time. This is the last chance, last chance for the parasites um, to feed and to collect souls, if you'd like. Yeah, collecting souls, collecting energies. Because the shift is happening where we're going to see who they are. So you don't react to them. You don't give them your energy. That's the worst thing that they could happen regarding um, humans and the parasites. For you to see the parasites on a human being. This is why the moon was being put in place. In the inverted commas. They don't want you. Once you notice them, um, your energetic... Um, frequency will change and you won't be scared you'll be horrified at what you're going to see because some of them are fucking grotesque seriously um, grotesque but whatever the human does or tries to do to you will um, be of no and, and they um, be of no um, impact the impact will be less okay so they and the handlers know this the handlers won't tell them this and whoever's in charge of the handlers knows this as well people know this this is why all they can do um, most people involved in my target like seeing the fucking dregs of society literally the dregs of society the pissers the sex offenders that's why this, they say it's one of those we, you know <coughs> excuse me they are one of us And they love it, love it when human beings are in pain. Love it. Or 
more anxious. Okay, I'm going to end on the last night. I'm going to show you how sick these creatures are. So the creatures, if you um, turn up your audio on this, I don't know if you're able to hear the creature beast in the background. Okay, so one of you know, Lucy Letby, okay, the nurse that tortured and murdered those infants, okay, that were in a um, special care unit, no, preparatory infants, the entities, the creature beast that targeted me, they love her, love her bad. Really like it, they get off, literally buzzing at the fact that she's killed so many infants, tortured so many infants, and that she's, she's one of them. Is that correct, family? They really get a buzz out of it. Most of us are horrified, that can't comprehend of what um, she's done. To these creature beasts, they love it. And they've told me they like her. She's one of us now. She's one of us. They love the fact that she's murdered so many fucking tiny babies. This is the mindset of the, the creatures we are. I am talking about. Okay? These are the people that are targeting me. These are the MPs, the fucking police officers, the, the GPs. They get literally a buzz out of that and they've told me because this program on the um, Twitter I'm fucking going on now um, where t and I don't I don't watch things especially because it was so it's so fucking horrific that um, purposely I don't watch anything that wants to um, provoke a reaction from me okay so I've been watching a channel that doesn't provoke a reaction and it's, it's very straight to the point this is what she's done. This is what has happened in court. This is what she said. This is um, the evidence that the uh, the crown used against her. Um, blah blah blah. And it's very analytical, if you'd like, in his approach to the case. That case. So I've been watching his program programs it's on YouTube um, because I don't want to be emotional. I'm already emotionally triggered just by the fact that it's on such an unbelievable thing that just tortured and killed so many babies. Okay, so that's why I was sort of interested in her case and followed it. And I don't, I don't need anybody's emotions to cloud. I just, I just want the general facts because I was like, and I knew. I don't want to brag again, but I knew that she was guilty even before the guilty verdict. Um, but these creatures, they love it. They absolutely loved it. They love that she's killed so many. And this is what I want people to get in their mindset. If it's just one person, it doesn't matter if it's just the one person that's killed or harmed so many people, or if it's, if it's a, a, a political decisions, if it's a religious organisation that harms and kills billions. As long as they're causing pain to, to humans, to humanity, they love it. And there are times where I think I've heard it all, uh, heard it all from these creature beasts, or I think oh, they can't do anything, I can't say anything more that would sicken me any more, anything more. But they fucking love of this child molest, this child murderer. I was going to say molester, and it's changed. This child murderer, and how they love her. It just takes it to another thing. Yeah, I'm really pleased what I said right at the very beginning. I'm really pleased that my family told me they're not human. You're not dealing with human beings. They are not human. And it makes me more adamant to continue and to name everybody involved. Um, it makes me more, more adamant and more sort of resolute. Res 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 anyway, more... Um, so, do you know, I spoke before, the last... Um, Recording. I was quite eloquent in that, even though I didn't go back before. I was about quite well. I didn't forget any words or anything. Now I'm like back to my old self. Anyway, so yeah, um, it made me more determined. And my, when I think I couldn't hate a group of people anymore, oh, fucking hell, yeah. I'm just thinking, you sick bag of cunts. And I can guarantee you, I will have recorded them saying, join us. Join us, be one of us. 
because they can't help themselves, they're so fucking thick. I'm going now, folks. It's been a very long time. But I'm just going to end on this. Just to confirm again, family, the creature beast that involved in my targeting love, love the fact that that nurse um, tortured, tortured and killed so many infants. Is that correct? One more time. So think on and look look who is targeting me. I'm going now, folks. Right, and it's got dead on. Okay, so I went off different. Oh, there's loads of them about tonight. Um, loads of subjects. I don't know if it made sense. I wanted to start um, with just to say if I'm protected, if, if I've got um, people that in my life that I've known that have passed, that have sort of like petitioned um, the elders. Like I say, I'm new, just using the term elders, but no other phrase for it for them to be smited um, and for them to be punished regarding the targeting um, and that they followed me throughout my life okay it's not following me all the time but periodically I've shown up throughout my life let's go back so not just involved in the targeting program anybody that sort of systematically um, wanted to cause harm to you um, or to me I should say there we go. They have been punished. I was meant to say this week's ago, but I got quite um, shy is not the word. I'm very reticent to tell you everything and to say everything. There we go. And I wasn't going to say, and I want to say something else, what they've told me as well, another time, okay? Uh, so I was very resistant to say that, so I sort of like, just think, okay, I'm not going to say that. I just that's going to sort of expand and contract the moon. But it's not just me that's protected. And this is the time when our family members, people that have loved us in the past, that have since passed, come in and step in. This is not going to happen to just me. Well, you're going to be being so you, you don't even know you're being protected. We don't. Things have happened in this world, whereas collectively, our um, creators have stopped it, stopped things from being worse. If you can imagine that. But now it's going to happen in it on an individual basis. Okay. Um, and it's only because of contact that I can say this and, and put it out there. So I'm going now. I hope this post makes sense. But like next time, yeah, I'm going to talk um, regarding race. Um, God, sexual deviance. Um, and we are not the only ones. Um, we are not alone. We may think that we are alone in this world, but we are not. You have people, um, entities that could link to the creators that have got your back. And as long as you don't sell out, as long as you um, hold on. And they will instill fear in you. They will threaten to kill you. They will threaten, they will threaten to kill your family members. They will um, threaten to rape you. Like I said, I've had rape threats from Chanel, Wilson, Chanel Campbell. Okay, um, from ex-boyfriends, um, from people who don't even know that I've been friends with, anybody that I'm connected to, that part of this targeting program that I've rejected, especially since moving to Derby. I don't know what's that about. And it's not just them; you've got to think of people around them who are covering for them. But as long as you hold on, um, and no fear is not part of 
we're not meant to be fearful of these entities but they're trying to create fear like i said in my last post they're trying to control my emotions and also said in my last post because the illnesses i've got so quite suffer from severe pain at times and i know there's times where i energetically spiritually haven't got the energy to deal with them to block them and my family have stepped in and blocked them is that correct And like I said in the other post, you, there's a recording where they see the energies coming into me or whatever. They see me glowing. Even when I feel like shit, apparently I glow. Um, and they're, trying, they're talking amongst themselves. Is there any way we could block it? Should we block it? Should we block it? And these are the dregs of society, folks. These are the piss heads. These, these are literally the dregs. These are the child molesters, the rapists. The wide boys who think the gangsters. These are these are highly educated, highly um, specialised team of people. In a vertical commas, they're the dregs of society, and you've got to. And even they don't even realize why are they using you? No offence. Yes, in fact, offence. Atten- no intended why are they using somebody like you why are they using racist why are they using you anyway yeah folks i'm going out i've gone off on one um and i'm going to continue to use my what's going on with me the targeting as an example, I wasn't before. My family says, yes, use it. Isn't that correct? Say it again. I'm going to say it again. Um, confirm that for me, family. Okay, so they told me to use the targeting and what was happening to me uh, as an example and what's happening to all of us worldwide. I can't tell you... Um, the amount of gaslighting, the amount of mocking, the amount of racist abuse, the amount of, the amount of sexual deviant threats. These creatures have perpetrated against me um, and who are involved. Knowing all of this, literally knowing all of this and think, oh, I'm part of the system now. Oh, you are hiding behind their job titles, but hiding behind... Um, their religion hiding beyond their gender their class like I say one of the people I'm going to sort of say um, is a psychiatrist it's a female white middle class woman you won't think it could be so fucking disgusting as an entity she's the one that um, yeah you watch it people are being sick literally of vomiting and it's their subconscious seeing the insectoids on her. Okay, you've got a brief flash of a craft that's cloaking itself out. If you've got um, equipment where you could slow it down, just then about a few minutes ago, about a minute ago, 30 seconds ago, I don't know when, I can't, lost all time, lost all sense of time. Anyway, yeah, so yeah, don't know what I was going to say then. So it's no matter who you are in the world listen we're all going to die all of us anybody watching this you're going to die where do you want your soul to go when you die you want it to go back to your clan where you originally came from or do you want the parasites um to take you to what I don't know where they are from the abyss um, to continue torturing you and when you have no body you've got nobody um, to go to at that point when, when they die they're going to be tortured no matter um, the strongest entity that's attached to them when they die that is the being that's going to torture them and they need to be to- is that correct family okay Um, and they need to be tortured because they need to exact the demons the entities energy from the energetic mass 
who was once human. The fear of pain, the fear of fear, etc. I've gone on long enough and I think I'm just repeating myself now regarding, but I will go come back. Oh, there's quite a few of the man in the night sky, folks. Um, and talk again regarding um, yeah, race, gender, sex. I th it might all change, but definitely regarding the, the race um, factor. Um, and I'm talking about all races, not just black. Any, if you've got a you to your skin colour, okay. Um, let's pop one there. Let's see if I can, in between the trees. If you've got a you to your skin colour. All you've got to do is go back through history. It's like there's a, cl oh, there's a cluster of them. I think I'm um, I think we're going to pick them up. So we just need Yeah, there's a cluster. The phone won't pick it up folks, I know. So thank you to my family, then when I shoot off folks. Right on camera. Sometimes I'm quite organised, aren't I? In my opinion, I've got I'm quite um disciplined what I'm gonna talk about and there's times like this I've just gone on onto various subjects. And hopefully when I've said it regarding um the race and how these parasitic entities or use race are using race are targeting um, people with a hue to their skin tone to get them into relationships with people that haven't got a hue to their skin tone so they never connect um, with their clan they never connect to the creators and that's something for anybody who knows me that's something I would never ever thought of saying out loud <laughs> I, I didn't even think it was me saying out loud. I didn't even think it. Didn't even think it. Um, but it's only because of the targeting program, not because um, my family, but because of the people involved and who they target and what they tar target and why. I'm going now, folks. So, thank you, family. Thank you. And hopefully when I come back next time, I'll remember where I've left off. And I just remembered another thing to add to next time as well. But for now, folks, bye.